Sometimes at Foxtrot, we even represent foster parents or non-relatives who are trying to get custody of their children. And I would say that in those situations, it's just as important to have an attorney who can benefit on their behalf because really in those cases, it's kind of a lot of people who are trying to get custody of these children. So you wanna make sure that you're able to uh, present yourself in the best light to be able to show the judge that that child best interest would be served with you. Most of the time, DHR's permanency goal, as they say, is return to parent or a relative placement. So as far as the foster parents go, they don't really play much of a role in DHR's case unless you're able to get an attorney and actually intervene and advocate on behalf of yourself. The lawyer for DHR does not represent the foster parents. The lawyer for DHR only represents DHR and they're trying to make sure that the children are in the uh, safest home for them. And for DHR's purposes, that doesn't always mean the foster home. At Foxtrot, we've had numerous cases where grandparents have tried to get custody of children in DHR cases. Um, and it's important that they are able to intervene in those cases because unlike a uh, foster parent who may have been a stranger to the child the month before, the children have already bonded with these grandparents. And if they are the safest, most stable, and most familiar option for the child, ultimately that could be the best place for them to go live. And so that grandparent is gonna need an attorney to make sure that they are able to enter that case procedurally correct and to be able to advocate on their behalf. DHR cases can be very complex because the Alabama Department of Human Resources has their own administrative code as far as it comes to what their policy is on how to deal with placing children in certain environments and how to protect children. And that code doesn't always align with how things may play out in court. Uh, so it's important to be able to get an attorney who knows how to uh, completely advocate on your behalf and to be able to um, align the law with what the code may conflict with and what the law actually is as far as determining the best interest of that child.